Thank you for watching, liking, commenting, sharing, and subscribing right now. The user known as Tuna asked the question, Hey Chris, how vulnerable am I to viruses when I'm using Vista versus XP? And as you see, there are people that are typing in which version of Windows they're using here in the chat room, XP, and a couple of Vistas. Vista, Vista Ultimate, nice. Uh, XP owns Vista, that's what some people say. And you know, you might remember when I moved back to XP from Windows Vista, I actually moved back to Vista because I forgot how much XP sucked compared to Vista in certain respects, and I found ways around some of my hardware issues in Windows uh, Vista by using uh, virtual machines, which we'll get into in another question. So the question is, is, are you more vulnerable in Windows Vista than you are in XP? Um, I wouldn't say more, I would just say differently. Uh, Vista, of course, has got a different uh, security infrastructure than Windows XP. Uh, as long as you're running antivirus software on your system, chances are you're going to be fine either way. Uh, since it's Windows, then anything that's written for Windows, any code, any exploit, a virus or spyware that's written for Windows, could likely harm XP equally to harming Windows Vista. So if you don't have any layer of protection at all, you're equally as vulnerable. Now, that being said, as I've noted before, Vista does things a little differently uh, in terms of how programs run and what kind of system protection you have in place. We've talked about UAC or user account control, um, which is the thing that pops up every once in a while and says, warning, this thing is trying to do something. Are you sure you want it to happen? That's something that Vista does. And in Microsoft's mind, that is a security layer. And in my mind, it's, it's an annoyance. And, and people are more inclined to turn it off. And you've probably seen the Apple parody commercial on in, Mac wants to issue a salutation, cancel or allow. They're making fun of that. That's the idea of Microsoft's idea of security. I think I said that right. So you're, you're not any more vulnerable if it's code that can be run on Windows. It's code that can be run on Windows. If you execute the code, if it runs on Windows, it's going to run equally on XP as well as it would on Vista, so long as you are just clicking the code and ignoring any kind of security prompts that pop up. So bottom line, run antivirus software, and I've got plenty of coupons uh, for you to use if you want to actually purchase uh, a, a title, um, tons of coupons, or if you want to use free antivirus software, there's uh, AVG is what people, a lot of people recommend, AVG free, right there in the chat room, you see it right there. So just as long as you're running antivirus, do it. You're running Windows, so antivirus is a, is a given. You know, not having Windows without antivirus is like having a computer without a monitor. <laughs>